are back with some more semi-final action right here in Season 2 of the HBL. We've got the uh, Shooting Stars and the MC Gang. They played Game 1. The Shooting Stars took that game. A very dominant win, 33-17. to They look sharp all throughout the game. And it's going to be the same starting lineups. Gotenks, Ump, and Rog versus Fireball, Snaz, and Strafe Helix. These two teams did finish the regular season at 3-3. Three and three, Had the same record. Shooting Stars kind of edged them out in terms of seeding, so this second game is going to be at the MC Gang home court. In the last game, Gotenks scored 25 points, an absolutely dominant performance by the captain of the Shooting Stars. So let's see what we have in store for game two. It is beginning right now. Who's going to get the ball in the middle? Looks like Ump does, and he passes it right through Fireball. Ump, going to take a nice pass over the middle to Rog. And Rog being defended, takes a shot, oh, nice and shot. Rog with a nice little two to get things started for the Shooting Stars. All right, picking up where they left off so far. Let's see how they continue. It's going to be a fireball in the middle. Gotenks defending him. Fireball kind of jumps over, a little side pass there. Rog is going to pass it to Strafe Helix. Strafe getting defended by Rog, going to take a contested three-pointer, and he makes it. Wow, okay. Strafe and Rog, both with some very impressive shots to start the game. Ump gets Fireball to jump off. Or, sorry, that's Strafe. He got to jump off sides. They switched up the defense after that last game. Gotenks gave up, or they gave up 25 points from Gotenks. So they decided, nah, we're going to just stop him now. Rog with a death pass. And who's going to get it? Fireball shows up eventually. But yeah. As I was saying, Fireball is going to be focusing a lot more on Gotenks this game. Oh, and Gotenks just stole the ball from him. Gotenks gets hit down as he takes the two. He misses the two. Fireball some good defense right there. Pass out to Ump. Ump gets hit. Doesn't get a good jump, but he takes the three anyway. And Rog is going to end up getting the rebound. Rog passes out to Gotenks. Gotenks going to pass it over to Ump. Ump's got two people on him. He takes the three-pointer again. No good. But another rebound for Rog. Rog passes it to Gotenks. Gotenks going to take the three. Yes, he is. And no good. But Rog there for another rebound. Rog is getting them all. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Uh, this is the most fun part of the game. When the ball just travels out of bounds and we got to wait. Just waiting. There we go. Fireball, bring it on over. Fireball, nope, wrong guy. Nope, nope, wrong guy. Okay. This is the biggest delay of a game ever. We should have probably stopped the clock for that, but uh, I think we're just going to play on. All right, Rog with the ball. Fireball defending him now. Rog, what's he going to do? He's got two people, two MC gang members that he's in between. He's going to take the three. Look at Rog go. And, oh, just a little too high. Bounced off the top of the backboard. Gotenks with a rebound. Something he doesn't do a lot in 2K. Gotenks going to step back. Take the... Oh, no, he's going to get stolen from. Fireball with a nice steal right there, but he gives it right back to Ump. What's Ump going to do? Ump is going to take himself a three, but he got hit hard. And it's going to be another Rog rebound. Rog is getting a lot of rebounds, but he turns it over. Fireball with the ball. Passing up to Snaz. Snaz, we haven't seen a lot from him yet. Snaz is going to take it up. Ump defending. He takes a three, but he got hit back. And it's going to be Rog there for the rebound. Who would have thought? <laughs> uh, Rog has found his role in the Shooting Stars, clearly. Rog holding on to the ball. Rog pass over to Ump. Ump. Oh, this could be risky. Yes, it is. Snaz gets the steal, and Snaz is going to take a three-pointer here. Oh, no. Snaz uncontested for the three. He barely misses. A little too much on the throw. Strafe is going to get the rebound and pass it over to Fireball. Fireball wasn't there, but now he is. And a Fireball passes back to Snaz. Gives him another chance. Oh, big hit right there. Snaz misses another three-pointer. And Rog gets another rebound. I, I'm not keeping track of this, but I wish I was. You, you'll see the stats at the end of the game. Don't worry. We just don't know them when they're happening. All right. Go Tanks with the ball. Passing it around. He is going to pass it to Rog. Rog looking to pass again. Rog doesn't do a lot of shooting. He's going to pass it back to the yellow team. Snaz with a good steal. Snaz is going to go in for a three. Oh, no. For a two-pointer, I meant. But he's actually going to get a free throw. 
Our first uh, free throw of this series. Snaz is the lucky one. Go tanks, making sure Fireball doesn't get a rebound if Snaz misses, but Snaz does not miss. And it's now five to two. Four and a half minutes into the game. Up in the middle. Trying to get around a strafe. He's got Fireball right in front of him. Fireball gets a good steal right there. Fireball's got to play that in-between role of trying to defend both go tanks and help out in middle when he needs to. Fireball played it very well there, but oh, a side steal from go tanks. That is a foul. Now they're going to pass over to Strafe. Strafe is going to step back for the three pointer. No way! Strafe Helix with another very impressive three. Puts the uh, MC gang up eight to two over the shooting stars. All right. Up with the ball in the middle. He's going to pass it to Fireball again. Fireball Ooh. doing a very good job playing middle. Or playing in between Ump and Go Tanks right now. We usually see Fireball playing straight up middle defense, but this shows that he is great when he's in between. He does miss the three pointer though, and Go Tanks gets the rebound. Nice pass out to Rog. Tight pass right there. Fireball almost got in there for the steal. But now Rog is pushing up. He's going to give it to Go Tanks, who Snaz ran away from. Go Tanks is going to take what looks to be a two pointer after he hit the ground, but no, he misses. And Strafe is going to get the rebound. Strafe trying to get over Go Tanks. He gives Snaz a nice lead pass right there. Snaz has so much room to work with. No one's near Snaz. He's going to take a three pointer. And that one is good from Snaz. The MC gang now up 11 to 2. It's a nine point lead. The Shooting Stars need to get something going here. They had a very successful game last time, but it seems the defensive changes from the MC gang are really messing with the Shooting Stars. They miss another three pointer, but Rog gets his 80th rebound of the game. That's not official, but that's what it feels like right now. Rog with another rebound. I don't believe it. I cannot wait to see the stats for this game. Oh, a good steal right there for Fireball. A foul by Ump. That ball will go back to Fireball. And the Shooting Stars are really struggling right now. Gotenks, who had 25 points in Game 1, hasn't scored yet. Meanwhile, the MC Gang lay on another 3. Was that Strafe again? Wow. Strafe having himself a game right now. Fireball hasn't even scored. And their team is up 14-2. to two. The two captains not scoring. Ump taking a three. And it's no good. Rog there for the rebound. It's, we're going to call it the Rog bound now. All right. Gotenks takes a three. And, and Dennis Rogman over here is getting another rebound. This is insane. I can't. I don't know what's more insane. The amount of rebounds the shooting stars are getting. Or specifically Rog. Oh, he doesn't get that one. I don't know if that's crazier than how many shots they've missed. They are struggling with field goals right now. It's kind of sad to see. Snaz passes out to Strafe. Helix Strafe takes a three-pointer right there, and it's good. That's why The MC gang are not missing. MC gang are doing amazing right now, and the shooting stars are struggling. Look at them. They're trying to switch it up now. They put Gotenks over on the left, but Ump is going to take it up the middle himself, and Ump is on the board with a three-pointer. This is crazy. Go tanks and fireball, not scoring a lot. They were the <laughs> they were the lead scorers for both their teams last time. Strafe and Snaz combined for five whole points in game one, and they've already combined for the 17 points that they have right now. Fireball misses a shot and doesn't get the rebound. Now it's Go tanks with the rebound. Go tanks gonna pass it over to Ump. I don't want to double. Oh, I'm breaking Snaz hard. Go ahead, go ahead. Here it's Snaz. Oh, no! I see Vulcan, take it on court, take it on court. Enemy has the ball. Don't die though. I'm deep left. I missed. Oh. <laughs> That's my bad. Hey, I got, I got, I got good things. Oh, no. All right, Snaz, that's your guy. I, I'm going to right. All right, sorry, I took a nap. We're back. What's going on? Ump has the ball right now. And uh, Rog gets the ball now. Rog is going to pass it out. Oh, who's going to get that? Oh, Fireball went for the steal. Didn't get it. Gotenks is going to put up a three-pointer. Can he get his first point of the game? No, he cannot. But Rog can get another rebound. He's been doing that very well. Fireball with a good steal right there. Fireball is going to pass it deep to Strafe Helix. 
on you. Oh, oh. Strafe is going to give it to Gotenks. Gotenks with a nice steal, at least. He can't get points, but he can get steals. Oh, he's trying to get around Strafe right now. Or is that Fireball? They all look the same. Those two, they got the same helmet. No, I think that was Strafe. Gotenks with a nice pass. Just kidding. It wasn't a nice pass. It's actually a turnover. Snaz gets the ball, and he passes it deep to Strafe Helix. Yes, Strafe is going to walk in. He's going to die, but take the two. Fireball is going to be there for the rebound. He's going to break some ankles. Now he's going to pass it around. Looks like all the shooting stars going for him. No, nope. Rog backs off. He passes it to Snaz. Snaz defending Rog. Or, other way around. Rog defending Snaz. Not very well, apparently, because Snaz scored another three-pointer. 20-5 to five with only five minutes left to play. A 15-point deficit. They need to make up three points a minute now if they want to actually come back in this. Ump is going to take a three-pointer from the middle, and he's not going to make it. And Fireball is going to get another rebound. And the Shooting Stars' hopes of getting to the championship on this game are becoming very, very low. That's your guy. Gotenks gets a nice steal right there. This is, for, this is to make it to the championship. The Shooting Stars needed to win this game. But being down 15, Ump is going to take another three-pointer here. And Ump keeps him in it. They're down 12 now. Okay, this is still very doable. With four minutes to play, I've seen crazier things happen. But a trip to the championship is on the line right there. And the defensive play like that is not going to get you to the championship. Fireball scores another three-pointer, bringing the lead back to 15 for the MC gang. Ump in the middle. Oh, I don't want to be here. I'm just going to grab the ball. Fireball defending. Ump's trying to get around him. Gotenks trying to get open, but Ump's just going to take the shot anyway. Ump does not even come close on that three-point attempt. Rog is there for the rebound. He's going to pass it out to Ump. What's Ump going to do with that? Oh, he's going to pass it around Fireball and Strafe. He's being doubled, and he gives it to Fireball. Another good steal for the MC gang, and very detrimental to the Shooting Stars' chances of winning this one. All right, the MC gang are really trying to push for a Game 3 right here. Anything can happen in a game three. All right, Gotenks is going to pass it over to Rog. Rog being fouled by a fireball right there. And that one, no foul. That is a good steal from fireball. 23 to 8. And this slaughtering of the shooting stars is continuing right now as Strafe is going to pass it to himself. And he's going to take a crazy mid range shot right there. And it goes in. The shooting of the MC gang has been incredible this game. Fireball hasn't even had to do much. His teammates have been doing all the work, but I mean, he's been a great facilitator, so Fireball playing absolutely outstanding, especially on the, on the defensive side. But his teammates have been shooting very well, which is nice to see Fireball getting a little bit of help. Right now, he's fouling, though, and Ump is going to take a three-pointer. And Rog is another rebound. If this were a game of rebounds, the Shooting Stars would be destroying the sh the MC gang. Rog single-handedly would be doing that, but a turnover right there leads to Snaz shooting a three-pointer. And that three is good. A 20-point lead with just over two minutes to play, and I think that's pretty much going to put a bow on this one. And it's going to be Ump taking out the middle, immediately passing to Rog. Rog is going to take a three-pointer. He throws it high. And it's too high. Ump gets the rebound. Ump is going to get it stolen by Fireball. Fireball has been stealing like crazy this game. Rock has been rebounding like crazy. But unfortunately, the Shooting Stars just have not been scoring like crazy. And the MC Gang have. MC Gang missed that one. Snaz went for the layup and didn't make it. Now Fireball is going to turn around. Take a crazy three-pointer there. Backed up. Two defenders on him and he makes it. 31-8. to eight. This is more of a... I thought the last game was a blowout. This is way more of a blowout. 31-8 to eight right now. This is kind of sad to see the shooting stars collapse like this after such a great game in game one. But they're going to have to bounce back for game three because it's all going to be on the line right there. Oh, there's a nice shot. Hey, this, you know what? A little positive moment for the shooting stars towards the end of this one. They're not going to be able to win this game. 20 points in a minute 15. That ain't happening. Fireball being defended very well by Ump. Fireball's going to get around him, though, and he slides past Gotenks. Or Gotenks slide past the, the offense, more like. Snaz takes a two, and he misses. Strafe with the rebound to pass out to Fireball. Fireball's going to pass it to Snaz. Snaz going for the layup. Oh, he really wants that layup. A Rog with another rebound to cap off his amazing rebounding game. If this isn't a record for rebounds in a game, I don't know what is. 
Rog must have the record. Oh, another steal right there. Snaz gets that one, and he's going to take a three-pointer. And it is good. 34 to 11. This is an absolute... I need a good word. What's a good word for this? This is an absolute... Uh, I don't want to say any bad words, though. That's the problem. We gotta stop this man. Is what we gotta Absolute do. destruction of the shooting stars. Simple way to put it. That's what we did. Oh man, another miss three right there. Rog with another rebound though. That's that's fun. All right, go tanks. You're gonna take another shot. Don't tell me Rog gets another rebound here. He gets another rebound. Why not? Give him another one. All right, Rog has the most amazing rebounding game I've ever seen in the HBL. And oh, there's gonna be a score there, but that will not count. It's too late. 34 to 11. And the MC gang have tied the series up one to one. That means we are going to a game three that will decide who plays against myself and the Samurai in the season two HBL championship.